Guess what time is, folks? It's Cruise Lose time! So before we start, I just want to thank everybody who joined in for the, our first live stream. Even though we have some technical difficulties, it will be fixed on the next one. And the date is coming out soon. I think we're looking at maybe next Friday night. So I will post it so you all can see. So this news is more about the channel news right now, right? So I'm in a pickle right now, okay? So right now, I do have a cruise book currently on the horizon next year. But you got to fly to Miami to get onto it, and I live in New York. And the pickle is the NCL Joy is also sailing at the same time from New York. So should I fly? Should I not fly, right? So that is a big pickle that I have. And the other thing is the Joy is going to Bermuda, which I've been on a couple of cruises already over there. And the Horizon is going to Amber Cove, La Ramona, Bonaire, and Aruba, or ports I've never been to before. So what would you do? Leave a message in the comments. If you were in this pickle, which cruise would you pick? The Joy, to me, looks like a bigger and a better ship. I'm a casino player, and they have a bigger casino. The Horizon, it is a small ship. It's an eight-day cruise compared to the Joy seven-day cruise, and that's the good thing. The bad part is when I go to Miami, I'm not going to be able to enjoy Miami because it's on Saturday. I'm going to be flying in after work on a Friday night, late night, so I wouldn't get into Miami till like 12, 1 o'clock at night. So if you're in that situation, what would you do? So I got some sad breaking news right now. So a passenger on the Carnival elevation intentionally jumps off the ship and is now lost at sea so while the elation was on its way back from its cruise going towards jacksonville the passenger a 30 year old male jumped off the ship the person he was with notified the cruise in the late afternoon and this incident happened hours earlier i mean the person said they were looking for for the person and for hours until they notified Carnival. And then Carnival did their own investigation where they were looking for the passenger. And then they went to the CCTV. And when that when they went there, that's when they um, realized that the person, delivery actually intentionally, jumped off the ship under its own will. This is a sad case. They did call the Coast Guard. They went and tried to a, do a search and rescue mission, but they did not find the person, and no one else has found the person. Right now, you could probably just assume that the person drowned out there. No one knows why he did what he did. I mean, you can only assume maybe he got an argument with somebody, or he has some personal problems, and you know, he just wanted to take his own life by jumping off. I mean, I hope. You know, they do find him, but I don't think they will. And, you know, we could, all we could do right now is just pray that they do find him. Hope you all enjoyed the show today. Till next time, everybody. Safe travels.